20 theorists and 20 theories. And here's a couple of them. Auguste Comte, the father of sociology, a French man, he coined the term sociology, the first sociologist that he knew we needed to study society. If we can study society and rules, maybe we can fix things before the guillotine. Emile Durkheim from France, the first real sociologist, coined the phrase anami, which means normlessness. He did a bunch of suicide research to find out that it looks like you have the same rate of suicide across different countries and different cultures. It's amazing, and he's really brilliant. Anami and normlessness, not knowing what you ought to do, is a term you need to know. And norms, the oughtness of the situation, the ought you should do, your shouldness. And that's all you need to know about him at this point. Karl Marx, though, he's a different cat. Here we go with Karl Marx. Karl Marx and Marxism. If you want to understand society, you start with the economic system. Karl Marx and money, money, money. Karl Marx and money, Karl Marx and money, 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 Marx and money, 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 Marxism. If you want to understand it, you start with the money and the conflict theory that there's only so much to go around. Money, money, Karl Marx and money, money, Karl Marx and Marxism and money, money, Karl Marx and Marxism, you see. If you want to understand society, you start with the money and the economic system. Max Weber, which I like to rhyme with Darth Vader, I've decided Darth Vader is Catholic, and since Darth Vader is Catholic, Max Weber said that religion is the key to society and wrote a book in 1904 entitled The Spirit of Capitalism and the Protestant Ethic. And he's a good kid. Then there's the frog. Herbert Spencer, survival of the fittest. He's the frog that ate the tadpole, ate the egg. It always works like that. And Darwin liked to do crap on frogs, and so that's why Darwinism is how Herbert Spencer got his social theory out. Survival of the fittest. Frog eats the egg, the egg eats doesn't eat anybody. That's survival of the theorists. That's the fittest. He recommended letting the poor die and letting the rich continue. What a jerk. George Herbert Mead was an American and a founder of the Symbolic Interactions. So was C. Rott Mills, another American with a sociological perspective. Now the sociological perspective is understanding human behavior by placing it within its broader social context. And that's what it is sociological perspective, which the three main ones we already learned about are functionalism, symbolic interaction, interaction, and conflict theory. And that's the theorists. Ta-da.